three independent experts. The first expert, the court appointed, was Dr. Daniel Tressler. Dr. Tressler examined uh, Miss Anthony on Saturday, late Saturday morning, uh, Saturday afternoon. Uh, the court also appointed Dr. Harry McLaren out of Quincy, Florida. Dr. McLaren examined Ms. Anthony on Saturday evening and some on Sunday. The court also appointed Dr. Ryan Hall who uh, examined Ms. Anthony on Sunday. Both sides willing to stipulate that the court may utilize the reports that were submitted by the doctors in making the determination on the issue of competency to proceed. What says the state of Florida? The state will stipulate, Your Honor. And the defense? No objections on that. Okay. Now, as both sides had an opportunity to review the reports of the three uh, experts in this area. Yes, the defense has. Okay. Based upon the reports that the court has reviewed, the court will find that the defendant is competent to continue to proceed. Those reports will be filed, but pursuant to law, those reports will remain under seal. The originals now will be filed with the clerk of the court. Okay, are there any other matters we need to take up prior to uh, resuming testimony in this case? I think y'all have uh, cleared up any matters dealing with Dr. Ferdin? Yes, we have. Yes, sir. There is, for the, for the record, there is no issue. Okay. Mr. Ashton? That's correct. Okay, the court will file uh, into the record the motion to determine competency to proceed and the court's emergency orders appointing experts. Let me see that one for just a second. Huh? Not the, the report, I mean the motion to determine competency on the law can't be sealed. Not at this time. Just a second. Let me see that other. Okay, just a second. Mr. Baez. We're ready, Your Honor. 